to my channel you guys this is another beautiful morning and why am i even happy today is atinental day your baby girl will be going to the atinental please ignore the noise heat you can call yeah you guys i'll be going to the hospital today and i'm also going to be visiting the radiography section for scan i'm all set i don't know if i'm talking these days eh? i had to catch my breath before it was up hi Chineke. Yeah, guys, I'm not driving though, but I've called someone who will come and pick me up. So the guy is coming. I'll see you guys when he's here or in the scan. Yeah. So let's go find out and know how our baby is doing. So guys, we got back from church right now. I bought pear. This is pear. So I'm going to just put hot water in it. I want to prepare food. I'm so, so hungry. Guys, food is ready. I want to go and quickly eat before I now go. Jeez, I'll see you guys when I'm done eating. Okay. Three hours later. Hey guys, welcome back again to my channel. If you're seeing this beautiful face for the first time, my name is Uma. I'm a mommy YouTuber, lifestyle vlogger, my village lifestyle vlogger, living right here in the city of Illinois Forest in Nigeria. So, guys, today, please uh, ignore the noise. The washing machine is on. That washing machine can make noise. But yeah, guys, it's how many days since I last saw? Yeah, since my last upload. I was supposed to upload that video a long time ago. But yeah, I i'm just uploading it now there's something that happened to me on that day of scan stroke at nenta i don't use the same hospital like the hospital i used although my doctor was one who you know how they refer you to a, a, a scan another place to go do your scan just so you'll be sure and all that so the place he normally refer me to go that's where i went <coughs> i'm coming there you know how nigeria so the the place he normally asked me to go was where i went <coughs> you know how nigerian roads are there's one that is going up and the other one that is coming down guys i wasted a lot of time like i wasted like four hours because there were lots of people who came for from different uh, different places for their scans so you have to wait for your your turn i was so furnished i was so so hungry i didn't know if it was the reason why what happened to me happened to me but i'm gonna tell you so i crossed the first road crossed the second road you know that point where you stand and wait for bike taxi or kada or whatever to come pick you that was where just on crossing the second road, you guys, your baby girl slipped off. I fell down. It was actually my first time being disgraced publicly, like falling down publicly and someone helping me to get up considering my condition. People were like, do you wound yourself? What happened? I said, I me too. I don't even understand what happened. But what I know is that I fell. I slipped and I fell. I was so hungry. <laughs> I went to where I was supposed to go eat food. I went there, 
ate food. I even vlogged the eating, but my hands were shaking. So, hence why you guys did not see that eating part. The camera, my phone was weekly as in the whole thing was shaking so i got back home and i'm like i told my husband see 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 what happened to me or that i slipped off or i even sustained bruises like injuries around this corner but they are gone so he was like ah i don't know again me i don't even know whether i do but yeah i got home i told him he just used to rub on some part of the place where i felt injury or pain so you guys you know i complained to you guys that i'm having waist pain and that was the same spot the same particular side that i used to feel <laughs> it wasn't that enough so at night we slept off i took my normal drugs my normal uh, maternity or pregnancy drugs slept waking up by four to five o'clock in the morning your baby girl started bleeding like i said bleeding you know how pain and pregnant women we go in and out in and out of the toilet so i felt maybe is you is the normal wee wee that is doing me but the thing was gushing out the blood the way the thing was coming out was different from pain so i quickly shout shouted on my husband like we don't sleep he sleep in his own separate room. why i to sleep in my own room so i'm like i shouted his name i'm like hey please come on i don't even know what was going on with me and all that he was like ah what happened i said that me i don't know that was how we you know god get god dress and we get dressed ah, i must come out english that was how we got dressed and boom i was rushed to the hospital I called the doctor and the doctor was like, I should calm down, is this still coming? Getting to the hospital, the bleeding stopped. The whole thing stopped. But I was grateful that you know he was able to manage. Nothing happened to me. I'm fine, I'm okay, the baby is fine. You guys there, eh, please I want you guys to tell those people that are pushing me. Tell them in the comment section to leave me alone because I'm too hot to handle. Yeah. I'm too hot to handle but yeah you guys today again it's my birthday yeah today is my birthday no plans for birthday i don't know if hobby will be taking me out because your baby girl no longer drive i am restricted after the whole incident that happened i was restricted not to if i slap you i was restricted not to go to some places that is where in fact so many restrictions well, we'll go past it we we'll move we we'll move god is our strength because your face is not looking good so you guys wish me all the birthday wishes in the comment section i'm just going to end this video here because this baby girl i'll see you in another